Hello friends, Erroneous here. Today, I'm thinking I'm going to do a bit of a redstone project. You might be able to hear it. I have my, uh, it's like right up against this wall here. Yeah, I've got my uh, sorting system running and I am cleaning up my miscellaneous chests and I just realized that's not going to be cleaning up very well, is it? Dang it. So, the idea for today is what if I were to just completely tear out the sorting system because it's, it's pretty sucky, not going to lie. Um, honestly, I don't think I've shown you the back of it yet. Huh, I should do that. Anyway, this system is extremely large, extremely unwieldy, and it uh, just does not sort the way I'd like it to sort. So this entirety of it on the side that I'm walking on right now is sorting into those first few chests there. And then what doesn't get sorted out comes across here to the other side and then gets sorted out into non-stackable and stackable by this device here. But that's that's pretty horrid, because if I want to add another item to it, like say I want to add honey blocks to my redstone chest, because, you know, honey blocks are great, uh, I would have to completely take out a lot of these filters and rebuild them. There are some other plans that I know about or some other redstone designs that I know about that don't use anything even close to that. They're just all around much better. And the best part is, they're configurable. Each of the slots that you have is just an empty chest, and then you make the chest not empty <laughs> to have it filter things out. So like, if I were to, if I were to do like that, then it would sort out redstone ore and coal ore, although I'd have to fill in the rest of these spaces here. So I'm thinking about switching to one of those types of systems because it would be a lot cheaper, I would get a lot of hoppers back from it, and it would uh, be much more configure uh, configurable. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to finish emptying these shulker boxes out first because that'll clean up the base a lot on its own. I'll let you guys know when I've finished that, and then we'll get started. Oh yeah, remind me never to flip this lever while the machine is running, if I want it to stay in... to stay sorted. Although I suppose it won't really matter, but... I suppose it won't really matter by the time this comes out, though. Fingers crossed, if you hear a piston, something broke. Okay, good. You know what I'm gonna like about this new storage system? You can take shulker boxes in the same format that you would have one of these barrels set up, and it would allow you to just fill your shulker box by placing it next to one of the hoppers on it. So I just came upstairs while that thing was running to look through some of the chests up here. I found a map of Dragon Peaks, which I still have to go build something in, and I also found this. Oh, Cosmo. This is the one that's going to take the longest. I made sure that it is completely and utterly full, because I kind of want to find out how long it takes to completely drain a, to completely drain a shulker through a hopper. Alright, I'm going to stop at about one stack early, because... I uh, threw probably right around a stack, yeah, I probably threw about a stack and a half of stuff in there. So I'll stop it pretty close to here. And time. That is about 11 minutes for a full shulker box. I've put together a little care package for Cosmo. It's a wonderful title, and I gave him some wing nuts. <laughs> got some of the loot that I got from the end, because it's pretty cheap. Bunch of boats, because, you know, boats. And then the four maps that I have right there. 
that are approximately in total uh, 16 square kilometers. A little bit over, but not not much. I honestly don't know where to put it, so he'll find it. I may have to just send him a message. Because uh, <laughs> I have no idea where he's going to be. Because he basically just hangs around my base most of the time. You know what, I think I'm just going to go put it at his base, and if he wants it, he can go get it, because it's at his base. And that's a lot of mobs, and I don't really want to deal with that right now, so... I'm just going to put it up in a tree. Put it right there. Get my banner on top. And then put the jack of all spades on front. And that's it. Time to start tearing it out. Coming along rather well with the clear out. I did also do a little bit of research into the type of sorting system I was working on. And I only actually found one video on something similar and it was made by Tango Tech in 2017. I'll probably put a link to that video in the description but I'm going to be developing my own version because it doesn't quite fit the design that I want to put on it. Alright, I'm here in my testing world. I'm in the survival feasible section of it. I have built up a bit of a mock-up of the storage room, or at least one side of it. I'm going to try to make a tileable system that will allow me to fill it with what I need. You know, I keep hating on quasi-connectivity, but I gotta admit, if it is an intended game feature, I probably wouldn't care as much. Like sure it's uh, it still doesn't match with the rest of redstone and I but I can definitely see its uses. If Mojang were ever to come out and say hey this is actually an intended feature we are going to be supporting any builds that contain it from here on out then sure I'd start using it. But as it currently is as it currently stands, I, I could definitely see it getting patched out sometime in the near future. Day... I think it's three now. Minecraft days, of course. I am now about 7,000, maybe 8,000 blocks from spawn, and I still haven't found any beehives. They're supposed to spawn in, in the... Uh, Oh, I'm not in Wooded Hills anymore. That might be part of it. Uh, you stupid mother! <laughs> I'm here too. Uh, well, not here, here. He's back at his base, but... Oh, yeah. I'm on the server. Now, where the hell is it? Yeah. Fixing my storage. I don't know where it went. Oh, well. I'll just keep oh, yeah, going north then. storage too, right? Um, I've been working on it. I took a break. <laughs> I'm gonna be completely rebuilding it to be automatic again, but in a different way. Let's see, am I in wooded hills yet? Nope, still in forest. I'll keep you guys posted. Day 5, I think? I've just passed the 10k mark. Still searching. Another ocean monument, too. What's that? 5 now? I think it's five because okay. there's the one to the to the west of my base there's the one to the south of that and there's the one to the northwest of your base what about the one next to the M fortress uh yeah that's the one that's the southwest of my base oh okay and then i've come across two on the way up here so yeah that's five total i think oh wait no because there's um i think there's one in the northwest of the world which is actually that way for me because I'm so far north. It's actually north, uh, south, east, or southwest for me. Yeah. Dang, this one's a pretty good distance off. This uh, treasure map I found. Oh, now it's just taunting me. You know how I said that there were a couple that spawned them more than others? I just found one of them, but it's a tiny island and there are no trees on it. Hmm. <laughs> 
That is a big fuck you, isn't it? Yeah. This is turning into quite the profitable trip. I've made four diamonds, two heart of the seas, a golden apple, yeah, just various bits and bobs all over the place. Dang it, I'm at spruce again. What do you mean you're at spruce? I mean I'm at spruce! What? Oh shit, what was... What biome are you in? Oh nice. I'm at the spa I'm at the spruce biome. Go to the next biome. Wait, what biome is that? Um uh, there's this one in like uh Extreme Hills Plus or something like that. It's super Which we're not playing, so it wouldn't uh, no no it's it's not amplified or anything, but it's it's extremely rare. I can't imagine that I found that one though. I'm gonna have well, to check and make sure rare, that that's then... the. Maybe it's like it's you fun. have to travel a certain number of blocks away from spawn or something. There's a really large forest around this, so I'm gonna take a look and see if I can find one here. Oh shit! Yeah, I found a bee. I found a bee. Okay, okay. Uh... So where, where's your hive, little guy? Oh, get out of here, creeper! Don't kill the bee. He's my only lead. You have silk touch and shit, right? I don't know yeah. how to harvest the bee stuff, so I'm just gonna leave it to you. Yeah. I also might okay. ask for instruction because I want to raise some bees too. He's Wait, pollinating. You know what? That'd be a really bad idea. I could, I, I could build you a, uh, I could build you a thing. I'm looking Dang for it, I lost him. Where'd he go? There he is. I found him. He's trying to run from me. I wonder why. I don't know. Maybe it's because I smell. I mean, I have been walking for like 10 days. Or maybe you've been chasing him for who knows how long. Couple minutes. Come on, yeah. little guy. Where's your hive? Go home. Mm. I don't really have to Wait. I seriously haven't collected any birch this season yet? Dang. Have you not? Apparently, it just popped up in my in my uh, notification thing like, hey, you have oh, new recipes. Uh, wow. <laughs> You know what? Good. Birch sucks. The birch is awesome. It's the birch sucks. the third best wood. It's the scum of the earth. Yeah, third best. It's so there's wood. dark oak and spruce. They're kind of tied for me, and then birch is next, and then acacia, and Do jungles way down thing? at the bottom. Um, silk touch tools if you have them. Sure. Uh, a time. campfire if you can get that. Uh, doesn't matter. Probably an axe. Oh, you're a little far away yeah. from your village, huh? I don't know about a silk touch axe, I have a shovel. And why doth they need a doth thy need a campfire? Uh to smoke it. If we want to harvest oh. it before we pick it up. Alright, sure. <coughs> okay, I think I may have lost the bee. I started deforesting this island to try and find the beehive, because he was circling around this island, but he kinda left. So I'm gonna grab Did my you find the bee box. No, I'm gonna grab my toolbox and go check out another area. Wait, you didn't find the beehive and you lost the bee? No, I, th I think I know where he went though. So I'm all prepped and ready to go for nothing. Well, there's you obviously one right here somewhere. And left me to finish myself. There's obviously one here somewhere. You just gotta come join me. Wow. What would your coordinates be in the end? In the nether? Or in the nether, fuck's sake. Um, let's see here. Let me do some quick mental math here. Um... There we go. Another coordinates. Alright, whew. Oh, I thought you said the first one was six. Oh, I found him! I found him! Nice. Well, I thought you said the first one was no, six. No, no, I... The six that's in there was an, an intermediate... Oh, I found it. It was right here in the middle of the village. Let's see here, honey level two. Okay, so we can't harvest it, but I also don't see the other bees. They should be coming back for nighttime though. Can't harvest, what do you mean? Uh, I mean, it's uh, not full of honey enough to harvest it. Oh, gotcha. Yes, a beeness. It has at least one bee in it. If I die to fire, you know why. Yeah. The chunks aren't loading for him in the nether. Can oh, I see to... your name tag. Oh. I see your name tag. Look down and to the south. 
down into the south. Mm -hmm. Oh, yep, I see yours. Yay! Yay! Dig to me. Dig brother. to you. Um, let me grab my shovel. Oh, hold on, iron. I hear lots of scary cave noises. Yeah, I'm putting my armor on. Actually, there might be a zombie spawner right around here. Did you get distracted and start mining towards other shit? Maybe. <laughs> Thanks, Erroneous. I'm only stuck in a cave. Hey! Uh, brother! We meet again. Yes. Alright, so what do we do now? Um, so now we look around in this forest for more bees. Fuck yeah. To the north. That's west, that's south, that's, that's east, north. That's north. <laughs> oh, Savannah. They sometimes have them. Dude, Just kind of flat and all of a sudden... Boom. Yeah, fine. Let's get up there now. Dang, this is some weird generation. Mm -hmm. It's like, cool. It's like cool. Do you see that down there? What? Come, come back, come back, look. No, I'm... I see... Sheep. I see clouds. I see water. I see land. I see... Ow! Did you ever just tell yourself to shut the fuck up? Yep. Mostly when I'm hiccuping. Oh, I just say stupid shit. Yeah. We all know. Thanks. <laughs> Alright, I'll build the portal here. Mm -hmm. Alright. You know what? One of us at a time. In case there's lava. Uh, rock, paper, scissors? Sure. Uh, How do we do that? I, I don't have paper. I'll use I'll use rockets for my paper. Alright, rock, paper, uh, like, Wait, what are scissors? like, sword, maybe? Or shears? Alright, rock, paper, scissors. Alright, ready? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Scissor beats what paper. What, what were you using? Throw me my rocket back. So is it is it oh, safe? safe? Okay. <laughs> Go, my lab rat. Oh, oh wait. Um, let me take note of the coordinates here. Yeah. All right. Got it. Yep. I'm following you because I don't know where we're going. All right. I'm assuming you've been somewhere near here. Oh, this is a cool yeah, spot. No, I'm just heading towards zero zero, honestly. Well, I'm heading towards Z zero. Ah, fair enough. I almost always use Silk Touch, actually. I very rarely switch over to F Fortune, and then that gas is really chill. Watch that pit. Yep. Oh, I didn't see that one though. Oh fuck. Yikes. All right. Do you want to? Do you want to try and go under there? No. Um. I can see land on the other side of that pit there, so maybe under. All right. It's gonna be sketchy, but. No problem. Okay. Whoa. Okay. Pull up. <laughs> Shit, I'm on fire. Oh crap. The good kind of fire? Ah shit! Oh, shit. You just got roasted. I died. I have your shoes, your sword, your Oh pickaxe. shit, I'm in the village. <laughs> yeah. Destroy the bed and just go yeah. spawn, I guess. Yeah, and then I can give you the exact coordinates actually. Ah, the first time that I've actually been happy to see those words. Your home bed is missing or obstructed. Alright now. If I remember correctly, Kakanina, or whatever their username is, built a, uh, a bridge back to their base. Oh, hey. Your experience repaired my Elytra. Cool. <laughs> Woo. Gotta look at the silver... the silver side. Whoa. The silver lining. No, 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 no! 
So many mobs. Oh, Holy shit. Oh yeah, it's the shit show. Wow, okay. These le shit show. And he put a wall all the way around it that you can't get back through, even with parkour on some most spots. Hey, I found the thing. The thing? Uh, the... I have another tether. Gotcha. Oh, shit. Nope. Fuck. Alright, Fuck. I'll be at your base in a minute. I will not. You know, now that I've led them away, I'll just kill myself, and then I'll... I'll try it again, because there won't be as many mobs this time. And they all <laughs> respawned. Dang it. That's my solution for caves and arc. <laughs> That's also exactly what happens when I try to go through caves and arc. They just respawn. Idea. What if what? I were to get... Oh! Nope. What if I were to get a creeper to blow up the wall so I can get in? <laughs> oh, there's a boat. Never mind. I'll just take the boat. Ha <laughs> ha. Big ol' middle finger to you guys. Ha ha well, ha ha. Dude, you lost a good bit of stuff. Alright guys, I gotta apologize for the audio in that clip. I got a new microphone, and I thought that the audio would be much better, but... Of course, the one setting I have to check before I start recording, I forgot to check it, and uh, yeah, it didn't come out great. So, apologies for the audio. Hope you all enjoyed, though, regardless of that. If you did, why don't you go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. If you really enjoyed, you can go ahead and hit subscribe, and that way you can see the new videos that we come out with right when they get posted. If you didn't like it, you can dislike, you can unsubscribe, whatever. I don't really care. Thank you all for watching, and have a wonderful rest of your day. Oops. Dang it. Oops. Put that back. There we go. <laughs>